Hi, I'm Dusty with 509 Stoves. Today we're doing a video demonstration on how to put our rocket stove together. All of these parts you can see, uh, there's not a lot of difference in the parts, but there's subtle differences. This one piece is close to this piece. They go in two different areas. What makes them different is this has the slot cut out, so you know that it goes up on the top of the stove in the cooking area. And then your middle piece, one side of this is slightly longer than the other. It does not matter which way you put it together. If you put it together like this, it's gonna be just a little bit short on the front. Put it together like that, it's just gonna be a little bit tighter to the door. So either way, it doesn't affect the way that the stove burns. So what we wanna do here is we'll take our first piece, which is this is our bottom. I've already slid one side into the other side piece. We've got our mate here. We'll just take this, slide it inside this one to hook them together. And then what we'll do is we'll hold it up here and make sure that that's pushed towards the back. We'll grab this piece and we'll slide it into the middle and it locks into these two little tabs here. Then we'll grab our bottom door lid and we'll slide it in to the front to where it locks in place here. And then not letting go of the sides, we'll kind of grab it up here. And this is your center burn plate. You can see that it's notched and it fits inside these two slots here. There's two slots on each side. So we're simply gonna slide it together. Some things are gonna slide apart and come apart as you kind of put it together as you're holding it. Once we get a couple of keep, keep parts in place, then it will be held together. And that's gonna be this one right here. This is the one that doesn't have the slot in it. And it's gonna slide in right down here. And that's gonna hold our rocket stove for us. Then we'll take our back plate and we'll slide it in like so. Locking it into place. Then we've got our lid for our fuel door that goes into these two small holes right here. So that's in place. Then we'll lock our top in. This gives us our four slots for our cooking grates and our final piece right here in the front. So you see it's very easy to build. We've got our two cooking grates. This is the difference is you have a top notch and a bottom notch. So you wanna put your top notch in first, slide that together, and then this notch fits inside that one as you put it in on the top, then you can cook up here. If you wanna make it a little more stable, then you can flatten out the ground a little bit, get this bottom towards the ground, and then it's plenty stable to put your, your pot up there. I'm Dusty with 509 Stoves. Thanks for watching.